The election outcome results of the ANC top five here at the Limpopo conference was not unexpected. It was very, very evident at the start of the conference that Stanley Matabata enjoyed support for a third term. You know that uh, this is his third term as ANC chairperson. Matabata's slate enjoyed support from a number of regions. That support was very prominent in the run-up to the conference. And you saw it at the start of the conference, which obviously came after some delays, where every time a leader would shout Amandla, the supporters and delegates would shout Chupo in support of Stanley Matabata. There was also signs of three fingers which showed a third term or signified a third term for Stanley Matabata. It was a clean sweep. He had won by more than a 300 vote margin between him and his rival Dixon Masimola um, and that was consistent in all other positions that were contested here at this conference. Now what does this mean? Effectively what the ANC Limpopo delegates had done on Friday was elected a chairperson for a period of six months because all indications point to the fact that they want him to take up a national leadership position of the ANC at the December conference where the ANC national leadership will be elected and so they were basically electing him for a six-month period uh, on a ticket to push him to uh, the national leadership. It's also quite important to note who else was a part of his slate. His deputy now is Florence Razzilani. She obviously was implicated in a report around the VBS bank. She's not been criminally charged. Another person who um, played a significant role in this conference but was not physically here was Danny Msiza. He was the treasurer of the ANC but has been criminally charged. He was nominated for the position of secretary but could not take up that position because of the criminal charges that he faces. But he does enjoy significant support in this province. You could feel his presence here even though he was not physically present at the conference when he they tried to nominate him uh, from the floor uh, uh, during nominations in the wee hours of Saturday morning, um, Paul Mashatili, the ANC Treasurer General, had to quickly intervene and say uh, he was not allowed to contest because the ANC rule stands that if you are criminally charged, you have to step aside from your position and that disqualifies you from contesting any other positions within the party. Now, what does this mean for the national picture? We know that ANC Limpopo is a big support base for President Sol Ramaphosa. He will enjoy the support in the conference in December.